What's going on guys? Sid here. Um, doing a recap of some mail. I still have not put in new batteries on this camera so I'm hoping to get this video done. Uh, got a lot of talking to do, a lot of yammering, a lot of babbling so we'll see how it goes. Um, so anyway I got two pieces of mail. Uh, one piece in yesterday, one piece in today. These are awesome packages here. Um, just get right into it. So first up package from yesterday this is who it's from right here coming from Club DeVoe in Raleigh North Carolina and if you look at the package you'll see the hats from the famous group do not bend be stiff so nice package here um, before we get into it and open it up here's the story behind it uh, the other day I was at a uh, Salvation Army thrift store um, getting some stuff and you'll see the other stuff I got in, a, in another video but I found these two uh, Devo tapes uh, this one here is oh no it's Devo and it's from 82 and then we have Devo 85 Shout from uh, 1985 obviously now this tape here uh, I looked it up when I got home on the internet and couldn't find out anything about it so I was like, wow. So I'm, I'm a member of a cassette tape collectors group on Facebook. So I posted both tapes there and I asked anybody if uh, any, anybody had any information on this cassette. Well, it turns out one of the members of the group is, his name is Michael Pilmer, and he is the uh, archivist for uh, the band DeVoe. He actually works for the band, runs the fan club. So he contacted me and said, hey, Sid, you know, I got to have this tape. We do not have this in our archives. And I said, okay, well, can you tell me a little bit more about it? Uh, you know, how rare it is, uh, where it originated, that type of thing. And he says, no, I, I haven't ever seen that uh, cassette before. I really don't know anything about it. It's probably some kind of a bootleg. Um, but we do need it. You know, would you sell it or trade it? And I said, uh, yeah, I would trade it. You know, I uh, wouldn't mind having an autograph for the band, you know, a signed photo. He says, done, we can do that. So, do I get both tapes, he asked. I said, sure. So I paid either 50 cents for both or a dollar for both. I can't remember which. So there's that. Let's see what he sent me. Let's see if I can get this open. Up and I'm probably gonna have to mess up this cardboard container. I didn't want to do that, but it's probably what I'm gonna have to do. There we go. Alright. A bunch of stuff here. So let's see what we got. A bunch of stickers. He said he was going to send me a bunch of stickers. Uh, we got to talk and then I told him a good friend of mine who's teaching in Korea right now. He's a big fan. So he said he'd send me some stickers and some extra ones for my friend. Uh, here's his business card. There's his information there. Michael Pilmer. And so here's some more stickers. Club uh, Devo, there's another business card. Michael Pilmer, webmaster and, and archivist. Very cool. Some more stickers. Another business card, give that to my buddy. And we got a couple of these. Toil is stupid. So there's that, and here is the sign photo. Now he was talking to me, and it says, uh, this photo has, I think he said, three original members' signatures. And then the newest member, the youngest member here, Josh. So we got Bob 1 and 2. I'm not sure who that is. Maybe Jim. And then signature, which is really bubbled off of here. This photo is really glossy, so I'm not familiar with the band too much. But that is awesome. 
super happy to get that. So there's my story on that. Alright. Try not to let all this stuff blow away. And the package I got today. Person coming from Georgetown, Connecticut, and this person paid 20 cents extra in postage. Uh, it is my 8x10 size SASE. And I was procrastinating on sending to this guy forever. It took me forever to send to him. Um, finally did though. Super happy I did. Just got returned to me very quickly. Uh, just been lazy, too lazy to write to him. And so the other day I just finally said, you know what, I'm doing it. I'm sitting down, I'm writing the letter. So here we go. He sent me some extras. Here's what I sent him here, one of the first things. And this is actor Gary Clark. He played Steel in Day of the Dead. Signed it right up there. Gary Clark. What is his character's name? Steel. Now I was waiting on, because I had written to Lori Cardillo, who played the, the lead role in the film, played Sarah, and she never returned my stuff. Uh, I had sent her this picture. So I was going to send Gary this picture when I got it back from Lori, but she never returned my stuff, so like hell with it. Now here he is as Steel, off-camera roll, or off-camera picture, I should say, off-camera shot. Hopefully you guys can see this, it's the bright sun. Signed that one, Gary Clark Steel. And sign it this one here, Gary Clark Steel. And he sent me two extras, two extra color 8x10s. Sydney, bang, you're dead.